Tuesday afternoon, students met in Troy University's International Arts Center in order to hear from a biologist turned artist. Dr. Arthur Bacon spoke to students about his art gallery that is currently on display in the art center. Dr. Bacon has such a colorful history uh, with his with his career in science and art and uh, just his experience with the civil rights movement. Although Bacon has worked as a biologist for most of his life, he says he has been an artist all of his life. The last 10 years as a biologist and college administrators was spent waiting for the day I could paint full time. As you look at Bacon's work, you may notice a theme. Many of his paintings are portraits, and he says there's a reason for that. Well, whatever condition or situation that the uh, individual is in, I seem to empathize with that. Many of Bacon's pieces reflect African American culture as well as moments from civil rights history. For many, Bacon's art was a refreshing view of the African American image. When you see an African American woman in media, it's always the light skin, you know, racially ambiguous, like super duper pretty, and now you have like all these ranges of skin tones and bigger noses and curly hair, and it is beautiful. I love it. And when asked about which painting is his favorite? My favorite painting is the one I just finished. And why is that? It's one I just finished. <laughs> so.